Hi guys, welcome to um, our system here. As you see, this is the special kind of, um, well, look, <laughs> it's Hyperlint, right? Hyperlint based on Wayland with all the issues it involves because not all applications work on Hyperlint like the Arch Link Suite tool will not launch and so many other tools will not launch. So use it, play with it, and then get rid of it basically. But enjoy it in the meantime. One of the videos was about a con key, right? Control super Q, so know your key bindings. A super C will always activate a con key on our Arclick system. It's a keyboard shortcut to say, go and run this thing. Now, as you see, it's, well, every tiling winner manager, that's the, that's the point, that's the difficulty, that, that's, that's the way it is, that's life. Every single desktop treats a con key differently. So here we get a window which is blurred because of my settings and then you get this conky in there. With Ctrl Alt page up and page down you can navigate through a variety of conkeys that we have, I think like 30 or something like that, right? And they will look all differently. So we're going through the long list that we have. And as you see, until now, they're all nice in, in the window, right? They're nice looking and they give you some information. CPU, 22 degrees. Okay, that's cool. Cool enough. <laughs> and this is Lua, right? Anything that has these dials and changes and it moves about, and often it's Lua. It's, it's designed, it's a programming language, which is interesting. If you want to do some first steps in programming, maybe, and then you take a look at the Lua code. That's how I started years ago. You don't have to start the way I did. You can start with Python or something else, right? Or Rust or anything of the languages. But um, as you see, up to now, and it's still staying that way, everything is a window. There's nothing we can do about that. Be happy and enjoy it, right? A little bit differences sometimes. Sometimes transparent, something a little bit black, but that's it, right? Now the settings to do so, it will not work here, but the settings to do so are in the config, in the conkey, and here are all the um, different conkeys, and in the folders, again, there are conkeys, right? Like this one is a conkey, that's one a conkey, 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 right? Conkeys. On the yeah let's go there on the um control alt g i'm gonna take if that's installed no control alt f then so chromium firefox vivaldi if you go to no yeah sure adlinks youtube is maybe something you can start and actually yes yeah, let's accept everything if we start typing conkey behind it and then even a little bit more information, maybe he'll find a playlist, right? Give him all it needs and see if he can find something called playlist. So Conky Zen is here, Key Theming is here, and no title, <laughs> it says playlist, no title. What? <laughs> all right, so there's a lot of, my point is there's a lot of information about Conky, so go and investigate not me <laughs> go here and then stop the video here don't ever click here start clicking here and stop doing that at the top and all this trillion of videos that's not how you find something conky here just on ours and in here you'll find maybe as well a playlist but here's a lot a lot of information about conky depending on the desktop you're on you see that's the one we started with right and um we sometimes we have videos how to create it, how to change it. It's all here. Conkeys are really, really covered. Like in the beginning when I had Linux Mint, I've made documentations about it. It's still the same Conkey, right? Now we're in Arch. Well, that's it. Think out of the box. Think out of distros and branches. It's all integrals. It's all the same. It's a Conkey. They use an application and use a Confi. That's it. So don't see any playlist coming up anytime soon, or I went over it, but this is where you find information. Of course, you find information at artolinux.info, that's the information website. From here, you go, go to the different uh, sources. I would probably test it here. In here, general, look at the names, 
design, design cookie a little bit more design wise. And here again, we have articles, articles, articles about conkeys. All right. Conkeys are covered. What I'd like to point out, and then I'll end the video. So this is it. Don't think you get anything better if you just do, well, if you just go for a conky inside hyperlink, then that's, that's what you'll get. If you're on something else, I recommend the conkeys of Arco. Let me take one example. Which one would I take as example? Without looking at the code previously, maybe this one, the Acres, or maybe that one. Awar Arcalix Conkey, right? If you go in there, if you take a look at the code, we give you so much information. This does that, this does that, this does that. And what we usually say, which will not work on Wayland, right? What we usually will say is change own window type desktop. Since every desktop has a desktop, uh, a window manager, right? Manages your conky as well. Then you have to say on that system with that desktop, I'm going to use desktop. And the other one I'm going to use normal or override or dock or desktop or panel. Those are the options. That's it. If it doesn't work with that, live with it, deal with it, basically, right? But there are videos about this specifically, but this is then just for Hyperlint. This is what you'll get. It's not any way around. You can try and, and see if this changes. But we've gone through the motions with Control Alt W, uh, Control Alt Page Up, Page Down. In all these conkeys that we went through, there are differences. There are desktop ones and override ones and normal ones and so on. So forget about it. The conkey is the way it is. Use it and remove it. Super C is our key binding to show it and remove it. And then you know your speed, your CPU, your memory. You know what you know. Voila, done. Otherwise, that I work with, so conkeys are not on my machine anymore, but I started with it years ago is uh, sensors, right? Often I want to know how much heat, <laughs> how much heat do I have on my system? So sensors is something that I keep track of from time to time. And GTOP is something I want to know if it's installed to the Pacman minus S, go top, GTOP. Let's go for go top. There are other apps, there are many, oh, maybe 20 ish. Oh, these things that you know, oh, what is it doing, right? I'm building an ISO, it's gonna spike all the way up to 100% and you can keep track a little bit of what's going on my machine. Who's using the power? I'm running WF Recorder to make this video. Of course, he's using a lot of power. Eh, that's it. So yeah, enjoy Hyperlint, but um, there are issues. Well, there are, it's Wayland, period. And some things will work and some things won't. And the conkey is, is the way it is and use it the way it is. Cheers.